Hey, it's Fred here from Plan Boo. We just wrapped up a biochar training program in Thailand, and one of the one of the developers of that program, his name is Kom Chalat. He's got a few different patches of land in different parts of Thailand. We are currently on this piece of land, which he has is turning into a bamboo farm. Behind me, you can see uh, he's got about 80 different species of bamboo back here. He's actually planting in companion planting with um, with banana and bamboo. Um, every every clump of bamboo has a banana growing with it. It's a really cool technique he's done. Before this, the land had been a cassava farm, conventional cassava farming, lots of chemicals, lots of pesticides. And so he let the land, uh, left it fallow for about a year or so and to let the let nature run its course. And then he started planting his bamboo and he's now applying some biochar on this land and regenerating the soil. And as a demonstration of what can be done with biochar, he planted these sunflowers over here. Now, before I get to that, you'll see most of, most of the land here, um, it's the tropics, so things really flourish. This particular patch, um, yeah, those are the sunflowers, but this particular area of the farm, you'll see nothing really grows here. It's very barren and not exactly sure what was being done on this part of the farm previously, but um, Combs says that nothing, nothing would grow here. And so, presented with that challenge, Comb rose to the occasion and applied lots and lots of biochar right here and planted all these sunflowers. Plan, the original plan was to do one side with the biochar, one side without biochar, to have like a good A-B comparison. But as sometimes happens, you put biochar on one side, and then when you get to the other side, you feel kind of bad not giving them the equal amount of biochar. You don't want them to feel like the, like the neglected... Um, um, you know, yeah, you don't want to neglect it and make it feel bad. So they put biochar on both. And so that comparison didn't really work out. But the fact is, as you can see there, nothing, nothing is really growing here and they couldn't get anything to grow here before they applied the biochar. And so by applying biochar on this patch, you now see the sunflowers are just loving it and yeah that are flourishing. If you look down below, you can see healthy quantities of biochar in the soil, and it's clearly made a huge difference here. All right, hope you found that interesting. Stay tuned next time for more good stories about biochar.